Captain Tuck. Uh, I'm Bill and Cho, uh, working as a software application engineer in Intel. Yeah. And now we are demonstrating a molecular dynamics application, and this uh, application is specific for empirical potential molecular dynamics. And it is widely used for uh, simulating nanomaterials such as carbon nanotube, fluorine, etc. We, now we are demonstrating a molecular dynamics application, uh, which is specific for empirical potential molecular dynamics. And uh, this uh, application is uh, uh, widely used for simulating nanomaterials, such as carbon nanotube or fluorine. So uh, this application was originally uh, developed by uh, KISTIS Performance Center, and it was running on Xeon. Uh, we trained KISTIS software developers uh, just in half day, and they could learn all the things, and they could put this application to a nice period just in one hour. It's because the problem model is very simple. So you can, you just need to add two lines in defining function. Just add this uh, single tech spec target MIC, MIC, and when you call this function, you need to add just one more line. Then that's all. So that's why they could uh, finish porting this application to Nice Ferry just in one hour. And uh, more, surpri more surprisingly, the performance gain was very linear. So we could get near the theoretical linear performance gain uh, on, on nice pairing. And uh, now you can see uh, interactively uh, 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 the simulating results. And the computation is done on nice ferry and the results are copied back to Xeon, and we uh, visualize the results uh, on Xeon, as you are uh, seeing. So what, what's the magic behind this? Is there a compiler that's, that's auto yes. parallelizing this? What's going on? Definitely, Intel is supporting uh, the same uh, uh, tools, both on Xeon and NiceBerry. Uh -huh. So if uh, you are very good at uh, uh, programming on uh, uh, CPU, then you uh, instantly become an uh, expert in, on NiceBerry. By pushing this button, you can see how uh, molecules are moving and interacting with each other. So the computation is done on nice ferry and the results are copied back to uh, uh, Xeon CPU and we can see, uh, uh, visualize this result on Xeon.